What's up guys, Giddy here. Welcome to my gameplay channel. So this is episode 2 of my uh, Pokemon Violence playthrough. I gotta get used to not saying Pokemon Sword because I just done a Pokemon Sword playthrough recording. So yep, I might get it wrong. Okay, last time we just... Uh, was trying to get a good nature for Coco. But uh, hey, before we get into that, don't forget to slap the Lapidon real hard and sub to the channel for free. So you can see more of these gameplay videos. So, well, what I was saying was uh, I wanted a Fukoko wow, um, I mean, with good uh, nature, either buffing special attack or speed. Okay, the first one I got with a, was a jolly nature on screen. And the second one was adamant nature, which, if you didn't know, buff attack and uh, minus special attack. It was exactly opposite of what I wanted. What I wanted was either modest nature or tamer nature. And then the third one I got was this hasty nature one. With plus speed and uh, minus defense. I know it's not really ideal, but um, I guess I'll just have to go with it. Because uh, loading every single time with this takes really, really long. So I'm not going to dwell way too much into it. And I'm just going to get over... I mean, get this over with. I mean, a hasty nature is alright. As long as I get a little more speed, I'm gonna be happy. Of course, if you whoop out your... No, I mean, your best team, then I'm gonna get completely crushed. Yeah, just like Candy Crush. I mean, ugh. Okay, luckily the Mona remembers that we're not playing Candy Crush. We're just playing baby Pokemon. So there we go. Baby Cup on the way. I'm just gonna go for an Amber here. Boop, boop. Oh no, I got all spent. But it does no damage. And I'm gonna two-shot this guy. Easy. Come on, Spaghetti. Do your best. Give me a best shot. Just gonna tank a hit. Mm -hmm. Super effective. Kapow. Yeah, Spaghetti is actually quite good against the Coco as well. Later in the game, because, you know, it's grass dark. And I'm gonna be a uh, fire ghost. So if he is strong enough, he might be able to KO my Skeledurge. That's like a minus defense nature and I'm extremely slow. So I might have to find something else that can, you know, sort of outspeed their starter. Yeah, it can be hard because that thing is extremely fast and it hits really hard. I mean, I took a look at, you know, the three starters and I decided, hey, the grass one was, well, the least ugly one. And of course, it's a glass cannon, which I love. But this playthrough, though, we're just going to try out some of the new Pokemon. Maybe something that we've never used in a playthrough before. Usually when I see these really slow starters that are bulky, I tend to not pick them. Like a Tutera, I mean, as timing is not that bad, but I just don't want it, because it's so slow. Now that I got this uh, through Coco, with a little bit of speed, I think it's going to synchronize pretty well with my signature ability. Well, okay, what's the name? Flaming Torch? Torch Song. Hmm, there we go. Torch Song. Forget what I said about that. It. It's Torch Song. So whenever you use that ability, you get a plus one in special attack. So, well, it's even better than Fiery Dance with uh, Volcarona. Because you know, with Fiery Dance, there's 50% chance for plus one. But right now, as a hundred percent to go plus one. I mean, talk about upgrades. 
and generations. Like, oh. Moves are just getting stronger and stronger. The thing is, I don't really like it. Because, you know, you really need balance in Pokemon, right? Or maybe they're just going to give stuff like Volcarona these abilities. But I don't really think so. I mean, these are... What do you call it? Uh, signature moves. So I'm not sure if they're going to give it to anyone else. Uh, this camera angle is so stupid. I can't adjust it. What the... can't even save the game i mean okay maybe it's just a controller not responding yep it is now it's a little better i mean my controller is really really worn out i mean sometimes it just goes up and i mean mostly up it's got a mind of its own so when I go onto the map later in the game, you guys will see it. Because I ran into this problem a ton of times. The cursor just moves on its own. Uh, mostly just upward. It's really stupid. Because sometimes when I try to pick a move to use, it just goes up and I use the wrong move. So, well. Okay, a sandwich. Sweet. Yeah, we all know where the sandwich is going. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yay, mom is always ready. And home is definitely going to be a place that we feel safe going back to. Your mom's so nice, kiddo. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's catch some wild Pokemon. I want a magic carp, right? Do I even want magic carp? I mean, Gyarados is really great in playthroughs, but... It sort of feels like cheating. I wish you went this way, right? Cool. Okay, what do I want to use in this playthrough? Okay, I think I want to use a Nackley with Purifying Salt. Not the sturdy one that I used in the second playthrough. I mean, yeah, I just used Nackley and completely wrecked all of those titans and then we started the game but right now i'm just gonna chill and do whatever i want no specific you know ordering nothing i'm just gonna do whatever i want oh oh this is so cute the chunk uh we're not moving, what the... Yeah, there are quite a bit of bugs in this game, so... I don't know, maybe they should have... You know, made it a little better before release. I don't want to catch this. But this thing though, the design was pretty good. Remember I said Gen 9 designs are mostly bad, but the chunk. Actually, it's pretty sweet. But when it evolves, eh, it's crap. Okay, 10 balls. Sweet. Yeah, don't worry, Nimona. We've been catching Pokemon since before you were programmed. So we are fine. Okay, I want to catch myself a Palmy. Chunk here. Give me some water Pokemon, please. Potion, okay. Another little chunk. There's so many of them. Okay, there's a bug type. I can train up a little bit. Oh, Hoppips. Okay. I'm gonna walk up here. There we go. Wait, can I find paw me in here? Oh! My bad. Sorry. Sorry I stepped on you. Okay, I might actually want Latchling, but uh, since we got a fire-type starter, I'm not gonna get it. Uh, how do we get up there? This. 
Okay, so many items already. Okay, let me fight some wild Pokemon. What the? What are you doing? You just got attacked. Uh oh, that's bad. That's really bad. Did I fight? No, I just want to run. Dude, stop attacking me. Just want to get some items and fight some buck types. That's it. Oh, there we go. Take this amber. Oof. There we go. Easy experience. Okay, now let's try and find those hop hips. Uh, where did they go? Seems like they're gone, sadly. Level 4, not bad. Good battle! It doesn't take a hit though, which is great, but it gives us a lot more XP. 29 instead of 9. I mean, 26 instead of 9. Cool. I'm learning round already. Because, you know, in the anime, I don't know if you have seen it or not, but... Okay, I'm not going to spoil on uh, who got this Pokemon, but... The Cuckoo loves to sing. Yep. I think you guys know that, right? Uh, what? Okay. Another cutscene. But I just want a Palmy. A mysterious cry. What's that? Hmm. Okay. Okay. I get this. There we go. Oh, hop it. So we gotta go this path. I know that, but I want to battle the hop at first. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we go, the Maridon. Oh, hang doors. Being rude as usual. Okay. I think they're gonna get scared away. Hmm. Falling off a cliff. Yeah, that's a matter. It's not like Zelda, right? You won't die. You're just gonna get saved by your rotom phone. Right on us in pain. What do we do? Okay. I can give it something. Eat this adventure guy. No, no, no. I'm not going to do that. Eat the sandwich. <laughs> oh. But the thing is, we don't need that adventure guide anyways. So you may eat it if you want to. If you're that hungry. But this sandwich is great. Our mom made it. Nom nom. Okay, okay. Mm hmm, so it gained some strength. Ooh. I mean, these cutscenes, though, they're just way, way too long.
So this is the um Wow. So this is the alternate form where Maridon wants to I mean, I mean the battle form, literally. So when Maridon wants to battle, this is the battle form that she changes into. Alright, let's go. We're just gonna follow it in, right? Because we can go up a cliff, right? We're just gonna follow the Maridon and let it take the lead. Um, okay, there we go. So, yeah. She wants us to follow. Hey, Nimona's there. I'm fine, I'm fine. <laughs> Super strong Maridon. Oh, the hand doors. Hand doors are like, oh my! We gotta run for our lives. Oh, that's a Hung Doom. Check that out. Hello, young, young goose. Just gonna get this item, don't mind me. But if you want a young goose for some reason, this is where you should look. Ziglet, though. Hmm. I think it's a good catch. I mean, I'll catch you if you sur- I mean, if you survive this. Oh, it does! Not bad. But the thing is, I don't really need a Diglett. I mean, I can catch a Duck Trail if I want to. Okay, one good design about this game is, uh... Whenever you feel like you can't beat a gym, there's always uh, some sort of Pokemon that can counter the gym really nearby. Yeah, take that as the biggest hint. But honestly, this game is pretty easy to beat. Whenever you think, oh, I cannot beat this electric gym, that's a duck trail nearby for you to catch. Just go right ahead, catch your uh, duck trail, and then come back. Uh, dude, please. I'm trying to pick up an item here. Wow, you fight like 20 hung doors. Is that like 10? Yeah. Boom! They're all scared away. I'm gonna pick that item up. Go. A revive. Definitely worth the time. Let's go, Maridon. Wonder when the Hang Doom is going to come down and fight. Boom. What's up? Yeah, it is powerful. Because it's Maridon, man. Let's go. Something's coming. Okay, that's a problem. Ooh, Hang Doom. What's up, dude? Oh, I love Hang Doom. It's so cool. Uh, I'm gonna battle you, I guess. Do Coco! I mean, can I sacrifice? Oh, I can't swap Pokemon. Fine. It's gonna get wrecked. You Coco! You're cheating! You don't even let me swap! My was like, What you doing? 
Get away from my friend. I mean, Hang Doom might not be able to win a 1v1 fight, but with his pack, then uh, this is a real problem. And Radon was like, okay, I'm just gonna escape. There are like way too many of them. We can't beat like 50 Hangdos, right? So let's just go. Okay, how does Nimona know this thing can fly? Hmm, weird. And just like that, we got saved by the Meriadon. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And this, ladies and gents, is just one of the cutscenes that's uh, in the early game. Imagine when we reach the academy, how many more cutscenes that would be. Oh, it does not have enough power. Yep, a cyclosaur. I'm quite interested, you know, in using one of those. Hmm, maybe I'll try to find one. And after such a long time, we can finally check out Diglett. The special attack. Okay. I think we're done here. Okay, anyone I would need to catch? Oh, Hop Pip. Okay, what's this? It's just a rock. Okay. Hop Pip, come here. Uh, how do we get them? Hop Pip, please. Oh, sneaky little devil. Come here. Ah, fine. Oh, another one of these things. But nope. There's yet another cutscene. Okay, who's this kid? Hmm. Hmm. He knows Mariadon. Hmm. Why is that? Hmm, I wonder. Arfbin. Okay, okay, don't be mad. I'm just here chilling. Maridon's true form. Hmm. Okay, another rival battle with Arfin. Okay, okay. I'm not healed up yet, so I don't know. I don't know if I can win this. Oh, we are healed up. Sweet. Just gonna go for the stab Amber.
Hmm. Let's try around. As you know, the cuckoo loves to sing. Boom! Not enough. Because it's the same power as an ember. But there we go, we got him. Ooh, easy clap. I don't know much about battling. I'm just a competitive battler, that's it. Uh huh. So, more cutscenes, please? No. You just leave us with Maridon and um, call it a day? Yeah, I second that proposal. Okay, Maradon's Pokeball is here. Cool. <laughs> the Mona got ignored so hard. Hmm, so the Academy is right there. We just gotta get past a Pokemon Center. Oh yeah, I just think I'm gonna climb this lighthouse and then end off the episode. This lighthouses in this game is... Well, it just means treasure, kind of. There we go, the academy. Yep. Pretty far away, so it might take a bit of time. Yay, the Pokemon. Yeah, that's what we are here for. We're not here for the scenery. I mean, a lot of people are complaining about, you know, the graphics of the game is really bad, blah, blah, blah. I don't really care that much as long as there's good Pokemon. But, and they can't even design good Pokemon. It is just sad. But that's it. Oh, we can't climb any further. So this lighthouse is not exactly... The best. But hey, we are down here, and now we can fight this Hoppip. Finally. But anyway, guys, next time we're gonna start our journey over to the academy. So if you love this playthrough, don't forget to sub up love and real heart and sub to the channel for free for more awesome Pokemon gameplay just like this. Now I'm gonna end off the episode right here. Have a great day, guys. And peace out.